October 19. A word in season to the weary by Brother Box Singh. Buried with him, risen with him. Colossians chapter 2 verse 12. It is very necessary for us to learn the secret of appropriating the power of resurrection day by day for all our needs. The Lord Jesus Christ becomes our personal Savior when we believe that He died in our stead to bear judgment of all our sins, shed His precious blood to cleanse us from our sins and rose again for our justification. Through such a faith we recognize we are planted together in the likeness of His death and burial and in the likeness of His resurrection. These days the best fruits like mangoes, apples, oranges and peaches are being produced by grafting. A tree yielding small and sour fruit can be made to yield nice, large, sweet and juicy fruits. One seedling of a bad tree is grafted into a tree yielding good fruits. By grafting, the seedling receives the nature of a good tree yielding nice and juicy fruits. The Apostle Paul uses the same phrase for our union with the Lord Jesus Christ in his death, burial and resurrection. By the power of his death we die daily to our old nature and by the power of his resurrection we become new creatures. In the Lord Jesus Christ all things become new as we read in 2 Corinthians chapter 5 verse 17. The Lord expects us to enjoy His power day by day by appropriating it with simple faith according to our need. Even though Paul the Apostle was mightily used of the Lord to establish many churches and also he had the privilege of being called into the third heaven and hearing words which could not be uttered in human language, yet he longed more and more to know the Lord, and the power of His resurrection, Philippians chapter 3 verse 10. In the early church also the believers gave witness to the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ with great power, and great grace was upon them all. Thus it is very necessary for us as believers to learn to appropriate this wonderful power of resurrection.